A boy is five years older than his brother. The product of their ages is 204. Find their ages. Now, let's take the brother's age to be Y years and let and from there the boy's age will be Y plus five. Why? Because the boy is five years older than his brother. So if the brother is five years, since the boy is five years older than his brother, then the boy's age will be Y plus five. That is five years older than his brother, which is Y years. And now we are told that the product of their ages is 204. So the Y years, which is the brother's age, multiplied by Y plus five, which is the boy's age, should be equal to 204. And then when we expand this bracket, we have y squared plus 5y is equals to 204. And this is a quadratic equation that we need to equate to 0. So this positive 204, when it comes to the left-hand side, it becomes negative 204, and that is equal to 0. Now, for us to solve this by factoring method, what we just need to do is to look for two numbers such that their product is 204 and their sum is plus 5, positive 5. Their product will be negative 204 and their sum will be positive 5. Please, we only use this direct method only when the coefficient of y square here is 1. This is like 1 y square. So two numbers that when you multiply, the ne they, their product will give you negative 204 and their sum will be positive 5. The two numbers are negative 12 and positive 17. If you multiply these two, you have negative 204. And if you add these two, you have positive 5. And then equate to 0. Then you now equate each of these brackets to 0. When we equate this to 0, we have y is equal to 12. Because this positive 12 will go to the other side of the 0. So y is equal to uh, 12. And then y is equal to negative 17 when it goes to that side. But we know that age cannot be negative. So we are not going to take this answer. So our correct answer will be y is equal to 12. So this is the brother's age. Now the boy's age is y plus 5. The boy's age is y plus 5. So you add 5 to y, which is 12. So 12 plus 5 will give us 17. So the boy's age is 17 years, while the brother's age is 12 years, as obtained here. So the brother's age is 12 years, and the boy's age is 17 years. That's the final answer. So please subscribe to this channel where I explain the content of my mathematics textbook from chapter to chapter and I explain many examples in each topic. So subscribe so that you don't miss out on the content of this textbook.